Hey guys, it's Bodie with IPTVWire.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install Private Internet Access VPN on any Amazon Fire Stick or Fire TV device. Now, Private Internet Access is one of the most popular VPNs used by cord cutters and general people around the world. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install this application on Fire Stick, some settings, some features, how to make sure your VPN's working, and then I'm also going to show you my recommended VPN provider instead of Private Internet Access. So I suggest you sticking around for the full video. All right, so to install private internet access VPN on our Amazon Fire Stick, the first thing we need to do is from the home screen, hover over find, scroll down and click search. And then once I click search, the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna type in private. And we'll see as I do that, it pops up right here, private internet access. I'm gonna click that. And you should see the logo under apps and games for private internet access VPN. Go ahead and click that. And that should direct you to the download page. And I'm gonna go ahead and click download to start the download of private internet access on my Fire Stick. You're gonna have to give it a few seconds while the application is downloading. All right, after private internet access has downloaded on my Fire Stick, I'm gonna hit the home button and I'm gonna scroll over and hit the apps icon here next to the settings icon. Go ahead and click that. And that's gonna take me to my apps and channels list. And as I scroll down, you should see private internet access right here. I'm gonna click the options button on my remote with the three lines, click move to front, and then I'm gonna click the home button on my remote and you'll see private internet access is right here towards the front of my apps list. So I'm gonna go ahead and click okay to launch private internet access on my Fire Stick. And the first thing it's gonna prompt me to do is log in. So if I click log in, it's gonna ask me to give it my username and password. And for the purposes of this video guys, I do have a paid account to private internet access. So I'm gonna enter my login credentials and then fast forward after I am logged in. All right, so after I've entered my login credentials to private internet access, you will see this message that says PIA access. Go ahead and click okay. And then you should get a connection request message. Go ahead and click okay here as well. So now I'm on the main screen of the private internet access application on my Amazon Fire Stick. And guys, right away, what I do like is this big power button, similar to Express or CyberGo. So I'm gonna go ahead and click that. And it instantly connected me to a VPN connection in seconds, right? And right here I am on the automatic server by default, but you'll see now on the right, my IP address is anonymous. So if I scroll through here, just I'm gonna scroll through a few settings of private internet access. They do offer hundreds of servers, which is cool to see. And if I scroll to the right, you can click settings. They do offer some unique settings here. So if I click protocol, they do offer the WireGuard protocol. And I do like that as that is my favorite VPN protocol to use. So now that I'm on WireGuard, you'll see they also offer port forwarding. You can change your DNS. Um, and if I scroll back here, I'm gonna click cancel. They also have an option here for block local network. This will you know, block access to your local network, um, which could leak or report your real IP address. So it's cool that they offer some of these features. One click connect is cool, connect on boot, connect on app update, um, and just some other settings here. But guys, they do not offer all the bells and whistles like my number one VPN provider, which is Surfshark VPN. But before diving into Surfshark guys, one thing I wanna check really quickly is if my private internet access VPN connection is established. So to do that, I'm gonna access the Silk browser. So if you have a Fire TV device, you should have the Amazon Silk browser. And I already have it saved here, but I'm gonna go to dnsleaktest.com. I'm gonna click refresh to make sure that I am on the correct VPN connection. And you'll see here, my IP address is now changed. It's not giving me the exact city here, but I do know that I have an anonymous IP address on my Amazon Fire Stick. So guys, now I'm going to launch my number one recommended VPN, which is Surfshark VPN. A few other reasons why I prefer Surfshark over private internet access are some of these features here. So if I click features, while you know, private internet access does offer some sort of malware blocking, the Surfshark clean web feature is much more efficient when it comes to ads, trackers, and malware on various websites. And if I hop over to VPN settings, 
Surfshark VPN also has a working kill switch. This is very important as a VPN user to have a working kill switch. And Surfshark is one of the few providers that offers this on Fire Stick and Android TV applications. They also offer more protocols. If I come back into protocol, they offer the WireGuard protocol, they offer IKEV2, and a few open VPN protocols as well. Again, I do have a special discount link for Surfshark VPN that you can find below this video that does help support myself and this channel. But that's it, guys. That's how you install private internet access on any Amazon Fire Stick or Fire TV device. Again, this is Bodhi with IPTV Wire. Appreciate you all watching this video. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, leave me a comment below. Hope this tutorial helped you out. Guys, I look forward to creating more content like this in the near future.